These visuals show the full scale of destruction that occurred in Wynar. 270 plus bodies have been recovered and more are being dug up with each passing hour. Houses and people were completely swallowed up by the dirt. Around 90% of the houses in Mundakai were destroyed, filled with mud up to 10 feet high. Survivors have the even more harder task of grieving the death of their closed ones or look for their missing relatives. More than 1,500 survivors have been rescued and a lot of them have been admitted to the hospitals nearby. More than 8,000 are in relief camps recovering from the devastation they were subjected to. Praveen is mourning his brother Prajesh and friend Chandu, both of them who died while saving people's lives during the landslide. Prajesh saved everyone, including our pet dog, but couldn't save himself. Praveen says heartbroken, sitting next to their pet dog. Babulal, a Jharkhand native, came to Mundakai with his family to earn money to build a house back home. Now, he has lost all his earnings and just wants to go back home. In the midst of all this, the only story that warms the heart is the miracle escape of a toddler. Eight-month-old Hassan was saved due to the quick actions of his grandfather, Opi Moidu, who injured himself in the process. Moidu says, as my house was flooded, I lifted Hansel above my head and moved out of the house. Every survivor will have a story to tell of how this landslide washed away a part of them.